very quickly. Hi, I'm Kieran, uh, and I'm a character comedian, and I tell stories. Um, so this evening, I'd like to tell you a little bit about the experiences that I had uh, going to uni for the first time. I don't know if anyone here did. Uh, it's something that I have very strong memories of. Uh, I remember the big day when Mum and Dad drove me down and dropped me off at uni. Mum bravely held back the tears, and Dad insisted on shaking my hand, and so my childhood ended exactly as it had begun. Um, to be honest, going to uni at all was a pretty momentous decision for me. Uh, growing up where I did in Yorkshire, it wasn't all that common to stay in education, and for a long time I just assumed that I was going to you know, follow the crowd by joining a poignant brass band and then hanging myself. But um, a few weeks uh, before the application deadlines, I actually I had this really weird dream, which I suppose ended up changing my life forever. So um, for this next bit, I'd like you to imagine, I'd like to recreate that for you now, and I'd like you to imagine that you are watching a dream. I was asleep in the dream. Kieran, oh Kieran, who are you? Who am I? Well, I could tell you, and will. I've been watching you for some time, Kieran, and let's just say I'm an admirer. You've got excellent grades. At the Model UN, you made a splash as Nigeria. You both understand and enjoy the news quiz. You're different from those other boys, Kieran. Have they heard of Baroness Varsi? Which is why, Kieran, I was a little disappointed when I saw your UCAS form. York, Chester, Keel, whatever that is. I feel some amendments might be in order. Let me put it this way. Your choices of uni are woeful. Northern red bricks are nothing but folly. I don't think you ought to sell yourself short. Cast your net wider than your local poly. There's a place I'm sure that you'd prosper, where elections turn everything blue. Neath the spires of Salisbury and Gloucester, I'm sure we can find the right uni for you. <laughs> Kieran, come down to the south. Don't be afraid of the south. Climb out of the coal mine, throw off your flat cap. There's a thousand prets below the Watford Gap. <laughs> Kieran, come down to the south, the sunny, the glorious south. Here's our prospectus, I'm sure you'll select us. Our higher education's the pride of the nation, so please come down to the south. <laughs> Sharp minds gather weeds in Bradford and Leeds, and your wits will grow rusty and dull. So come, feel the thrills in the home of Jack Wills. Drink scotch with Etonians, make jokes about Hull. Look! <laughs> There goes Martin Keown. He drives into town from his country retreat. And Nigella, I heard that she owns a yacht and a racehorse and half of the street. Kieran, come down to the south. Fit lasses are plenty down south. A lad with straight A's needs Guildford and Hayes. And did I mention money? We've got fuckloads of money. Thank you much, Kieran. Bye bye. <laughs> Three,